Hello, Sun City residents. This is Charlie Douglas. For your daily meditation, today's meditation is going to be how to deal with emotions mindfully. It's a four step process. Remember to find a comfortable place to sit or lay down. Turn off all phones, maybe even any music in the background so it doesn't disturb you and you're able to listen completely and easily. So let's begin. How to deal with our emotions mindfully. Step number one is to recognize what you are feeling. You can't figure out how to deal with an emotion until you acknowledge that you're experiencing it. Very simple. We have to acknowledge what we are going through. Number two is acceptance. We tend to resist or deny certain feelings, particularly if they're unpleasant. With meditation, we can be open to whatever emotions arise within us. We don't blame ourselves when a troubling emotion comes up. We remind ourselves that emotions are here no matter what. Whether we bid them on or we let go. These feelings are just feelings that come up for us. We don't have to take them on. Just notice them and then move on. The third step to dealing with emotions is to investigate your, investigate your emotions instead of running away from them. Move closer, observing them with an unbiased interest. Pause. Take a moment from your usual reaction, but also to unhook from the object of your feelings. Our usual reaction when we're caught up in strong emotions is to fixate on the trigger or target, saying to ourselves, I'm so bad at that person, so upset. I'm going to tell everyone what they did. rather than examine the emotions themselves. When we neither push away from negative situations nor wallow in it, we can respond with a new form of intelligence rather than with the same old knee-jerk reaction. When you switch your relationships with the problem, you shift your reaction to it. When we observe our anger or study any strong emotions, it's not one thing, but a bunch of things. Anger includes moments of sadness, moments of helplessness, frustration, and of fear, especially right now, the fear is going in our mind. When we notice this, we begin to feel that strong or painful emotion is more manageable when we can recognize what it is and stop and take a breath. Our fourth step to help deal with emotions is acceptance and identifying with the emotion. The embarrassment or disappointment you're feeling today isn't your whole resume. The final word on who you are and who you're going to be is up to you. Instead of confusing a temporary state with your total self, you come to see that your emotions arise, last a while, then disappear. You will feel some fear, then you don't. You feel resentment, and then you don't. 
The four steps are recognize the emotion, accept it without blame, investigate it, and then non-identify with it. Recognize, accept, investigate, and then no longer identify with it. We are not our thoughts. Remember, mindfulness is to help us get in touch with the part of us that is witnessing what is going on around us. Think of your thoughts as visitors knocking at your door. Thoughts don't live there. You can greet them, acknowledge them, and let them go. Mindfulness allows us to watch our thoughts, leading us down an unhealthy path. If so, let go. And for us to recognize we are much more than a fearful or envious or angry thoughts. We are loving, kind, peaceful beings when we choose to be. And remember, please choose the good thoughts. You will feel more at peace and more like yourself because you are love, you are joy, you are peace, and you are wonderful.